right. So we have some cool today, everyone. <clears throat> Got something uh, really, really cool today. Um, yeah. So I don't have my knife, so we're gonna have to go with something else really cool. We're gonna use this screwdriver. But today we have something pretty, pretty, pretty special here today. We have the Adidas Originals F22s, which actually came out, I think, about a year ago. But I've gotten them off StockX, which is my fourth pair of shoes from StockX. So thank you, StockX, for being very reliable and cool always. So I can always get rely on getting cool shoes from you guys. Okay, so looks like the box is a little worn. Okay, this is what we're looking at here. We've got the F22 PK in a size 12, retailed at 160, and I have gotten these for $50. So, box is worn, obviously, because it's an old shoe, came out a while ago. Oh, we got a size chart on the bottom. Maybe. Yep, very interesting. Okay, alright, here we go. It is unboxing time. Unboxing time. <laughs> Alright, so we got my receipt that has my personal information on it, so, you know, can't show it to you, sorry. We got the super cool StockX card that comes with all the StockX orders. We get a little sticker. It's my fourth one. Ha! Alright, let's, let's pop this open. Oh, alright, so the first thing I'm seeing here is some insoles they look kind of clean they smell clean which is <laughs> a good sign we have adidas atric outlast very nice so let's look at the actual shoe here it is first impressions these are very cool they have continental soles let's get these out of the box i got some super cool new shoe stiffeners at TJ Maxx for six dollars so I'm gonna put these in here hopefully they'll make them look a little bit nicer for the video we'll see these have the Atric logo on the heel tab which I actually quite like and then we got the StockX verified tag we got this really interesting pattern on the bottom super unique for Adidas got the little continental branding right there Adidas and this piece of plastic is supposed to provide a lot of support for the inside of your foot because it's connected to the bottom and then goes up onto the top like this. It's got some holes in it that don't actually go through, so that's just for style. Got the three stripes in this kind of silky, this silky kind of material. And we got the super cool prime knit, I think it's called. That's very nice. We got Outlast Souls, so we got little two collabs here. Continental, and we got the Adidas tagging. We got some nice orange laces here with some plastic aglets on there. Got the Adidas original logo. Nothing going on on the inside there. Just black. Got some more patterns around the ankle. I guess I'm gonna put these on. I don't know if I should use them with or without the soles, because I could preserve this cute little pattern right here, but we'll see how comfortable they are. So let's get these on foot and see how they look. Okay, so first impressions. There is a lot of support on the center of the foot. I'm feeling an incredible amount of sport all the way through here. So one thing I've noticed that I want to point out right now is that these are very narrow. You have to have a very narrow foot for this. The curves in this are very, very extreme. I don't know if you can see that or not, but, but these are looking really nice actually. I really like the way that these look and I like the bottom of them, especially. They're really weird. They're definitely kind of an acquired taste, I'd say, but I think I've definitely acquired it. I 
you guys enjoyed this super cool review. Um, if we hit four views on this video, I'll probably cry. Um, so if you want to make me cry, drop watch this video, and um, if you want to let me know that I'm really super cool and like boost my tiny little ego just a little bit, go ahead and Ooh. clap that like button really, really, really hard. I mean, I have 70 subscribers, which doesn't seem like that much, but it's basically a pretty large following, and um, I only got four views on my last video, so that's always really good, you know, when you spend a long time on something and then it doesn't do well, but I have a bunch of old unboxings recorded, but a lot of them I was sick or tired. They're not that entertaining, so I don't think I'm going to upload them, but here's this one, if it makes it to YouTube. If you're watching this right now, good job, because you freaking edited a single video and uploaded it. Let's go for five uploads in the year of 2019. We'll see if we can reach it. Thank you guys for watching this super cool shoe unboxing, and I will see you bros in the next video. Yeah.